next. This is two hours of drying on the rack in my laundry room, which is also my furnace room. Um, I don't have a lot of patience. It's getting late. Um, it's not completely dry, but I wanted to show you uh, what happens. Here are the wet part. Okay, that's still a little wet. Not ready, quite ready to take off. Okay, but up here, did I show you that? Okay, see the wet part right here? Um, here's the dry part comes off. You have some beautiful clean fur. This is after rinsing it several times. So this is nice and dry. Um, I could probably continue working with this, but it is getting uh, later and uh, I'm done. Here's a guard here. Remember I said there's going to be guard hairs in there? You can see that. Uh, there it is. I can pull that out at another time. But this is what it's like when it's drying on the rack. This won't go back on now because it's already dry. But this is nice and clean, smells good. Um, I have not put the the fabric softener on yet. Okay, that I do after the yarn is spun and it's on the knitting nodding. This is just the washing. Like I said, I rinsed it two times. And we're done. So if I left it to dry overnight, this whole tray would be done. In fact, this is a thin layer that I did. Usually I do much thicker amounts, and that'll take about, like I said, overnight to dry.